morning, Tuesday, 5th of May. Here from petrol station camping. Our friends uh, from England there, at 7 o'clock in the morning, they're already up early and gone. <laughs> we haven't even heard them pack away, so they're very efficient. We've never been on the road at 7 o'clock in the morning. But, uh, yeah, this is where we are this morning. This is where we decided to stay yesterday. It's from this region here, from here towards uh, Cars. There's uh, bears in the mountains here, so it's best to stay at uh, places where towns or petrol stations we've been told. So that's what we're doing for the next few days. Got a new friend there, Jamie? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> well, the first part is very straight and flat here. Nice hills inside of us. Not the uh, big mountains yet, they're straight ahead. It's a complete motorcade of election buses and cars and police. It's in the last few days. There's a must be election on, even though we don't really Check the news, Turkish news, but it looks like something's uh, going on. Oh, it's just entering the small town of Turkey. Only 5,700 people live here, that's not too big. Okay, the road, road starts climbing from Terkan, uh, from uh, 1,400 meters, got to go up over 2,000 now, so let's uh, see how that goes, but lovely, the weather's nice. Perfect cycling weather at the moment, let's see how long that lasts. Probably get cooler again when we get high up in the mountains. Let's see. We have to climb a mountain, it's not always nice to see it goes down. <laughs> Just to get the, get the climbing done in one go. Just climb a few hundred meters and have to go down 50 meters and climb a few hundred again. That's the way it is. The scenery is extremely nice here. Nice green hills and mountains. Beautiful. Great weather makes it much more enjoyable climbing mountains. There's no wind or rain. It's not cold, it's just nice temperature. Really enjoyable to be. Like cycling through Scotland on a nice summer's day. Absolutely amazing. The road just gently climbs, we managed to keep a nice speed really, just enjoy the scenery. We haven't had many opportunities the last few days to sit outside and have lunch, but today we can. Today it's nice, yeah. It's good weather and actually I can feel the green nature now, yeah. because now it's beginning to be summer, really yeah. summer. Yeah, it's nice today, yeah. Nice place for a lunch break here. So we'll get on the bikes again now and do a bit more climbing. We're climbing at about 1,800 meters, so it's going quite nicely in the good weather here. A little bit warm, but I'm not going to complain about that. Jamie wanted to go through the tunnel, but it's only for the other carriageway on the other opposite side. <laughs> Slow climb now to the top. Very 
1,900 meters now, one final push for the top. We should be at 2,000 at the top up there. And it's down. Just spotted the blue sign. Hopefully it says Rakim. <laughs> Let's see. And Jamie's going for the summit. I've been biking now 20 kilometers up a hill. <laughs> and you've still got energy for the last 100 meters. Did it, Jamie? Another long hill. So, it's time to go down again. Approaching 80 kilometer cycle today, plus one 2000 meter mountain. So we spotted a well, there's a sign on the road back there, bears, and the last 10 kilometers. So I was hoping to camp there, but couldn't camp there. We're in that zone, so now we're carrying on. There's a petrol station further up the road here. We'll see if we can camp there, see if that's okay. So easy now, but we can't just wall camp wherever we want to. That's, uh, that's got to be the problem now, all the way to cars, I think. What I've got on the internet this morning, so yeah. Let's see what we find. There's some nice mountains over there, though. Okay, we started biking this morning at nine o'clock, quite early, really. Now it's five o'clock in the evening, so turning into a long cycling day today. I think we'll end it with about 90 kilometers, I think. So we get to the next petrol station. To, you know, the road's nice and flat, so we've got a nice speed here. So spotted Israel in the distance. We just turned up on a petrol station again. We clear clear of the bear area. <laughs> But, uh, this was the first petrol station we found, and uh, a coincidence, so English friends are here, Fern and John again, so I'll have some neighbours again today. So there's uh, just enough space, I think, for our tent as well, so we'll stay here. Then we're just uh, only 28 kilometres from Ezerum now, so we should have a short day tomorrow. So, uh, so we should get there by lunchtime, I think, and then we'll have a one and a half days there. So yeah, we'll get the tent up and then... Uh, yeah, get the cookie going again and have another day of petrol station camping. Hello, this is petrol station camping. Number two. Number two. And the okay. two English people here are cooking. <laughs> yeah. One English person here, another one Hello. here, and your friend Fern is cooking. Okay, very good. Cool. Yeah. I told you really after all. <laughs> Yeah, we're in the petrol station. Petrol station. Here in the back. <laughs> okay. City you can see twinkling in the distance there, just about, is uh, Ezerum. 28 kilometers from here, so it's going to be a nice short ride in the morning. Should be there by lunchtime, and we'll stay there for two nights in the hotel and try and pick up uh, James and Meta's visa for Iran. So that'll be uh, quite good. See if we can do that. So, uh, yeah, that's the plan. Oh, we'll just have a 
night sleeping here, petrol station camping, and <laughs> then we'll be back on the bikes again in the morning and go to his room.